is September the 10th, 2013. We see here a Heidenheim Control TNC 430. Uh, it's the, in Germany, we say the four-ganger model from the 530. And uh, it's still a very nice machine, nice control. It's prepped with touch probe. Uh, here we see the two receivers. And uh, it's a 5X Australian table. You can see that here, 30.5 and 45.5. Very nice machine and very smooth axis. And uh, we drive it here a little bit manually right now around. And we make some more uh, head changes, etc. We go a little bit faster here, increase it, and uh, it's like uh, it speeds up. You see how nice that machine is. Z axis, up and down. And again, it's a Heidenheim control. Here, the Heidenheim control has also cycle 19. Let's see if you can see that here. Uh, calibration has also laser. And here is cycle 19 here. And uh, the tooltip followed uh, the part, you know, from the zero program, rotary axis, angle, degrees. It's a full 5X machine. This Heidenheim 410 handwheel, like 530. And uh, it's a Haydn, it's a DMU ADP with 62 magazine, 12,000 RPM, 12,000, not 18,000, 12,000 higher torque machine. 10, 2013, if we make a tool change, it has double gripper, how nice and quick that goes, you change back, vertical, horizontal, it's uh, two machines actually in one, and let's make another head change, it's by Heidenheim M53, M54. Uh, we can select that here, the same like TNC 530, the same thing, and we go horizontal, click on it, she drives her position, and she does that, and uh, it's a very nice machine, again, it has 12,000 RPM, and uh, 62 magazine, 60, not 32, 62 magazine position, and here's a laser, the laser comes out, has a uh, coolant through the spindle, has also a chip conveyor, and again, it has preparation for Renishaw touch probe. We don't have the probe anymore, but the probe can be bought from Renishaw, and uh, everything is a full 5-axis machine. Let's change the head back to vertical, just one push button, and she goes. You can see that in the control, and she's on there, and again, it's a full 5-axis machine tool, and DMG ADP, very expensive machine, we sell it for a fraction of a price. Has also a mist collector in the back up there, and it's HSK, HSK better accuracy and uh, better surface uh, from the tool table. This machine has also a new spindle from the previous owner, had checked out of 3 to 5 micron. Very nice. It's all greased in, that's why she looks like that, it's lubrication on it, etc. But that's how the machine looks like here. And the uh, table surface, we can show that here. I mean, almost no marks on it. It was in the R&D. And uh, very nice machine. Again, ADP Haydn. Tool change, I put another tool in the other gripper. So double gripper, double tool change, save time. Double gripper, you can see that. Tool out, next tool in. All quickly, and she goes back. Whatever he had programmed before, she knows it. It's a pretty uh, uh, good software. Uh, DMG with everything on there. And again, it's five, 430 control, and uh, it handles like a 530 program. It's millimeter inch, uh, whatever you like. It has directories, has files. You go over here, select your directory, same like a TNC 530. Uh, you can create directory on your left. Your files are on your right has calculator in there, you calculate everything and put the number in with one button, there's this one. So it's everything on it and uh, it's like a TNC 530, 430, they're all the same. It's 530 is only a little bit faster when you do especially impeller cutting, etc. But that's Heidenheim can tell you that too. And uh, again, it's a DMU ADP Haydn uh, preparation, 60 tools, uh, touch probe, Preparation, full 5 axis Tronian table, 12,000 RPM, chip conveyor, coolant through, laser, everything. I walk a little bit around. You can see that machine here. And uh, we have only things standing around. On Friday, a customer will pick up two machines here. They're all sold. 
and uh, here's the water tank we have that in the back and the chip conveyor everything is on the power feel free to call us visit us and see these machines uh, they're very nice machines under power by us cleaned up and uh, any question just feel free to call us thank you very much have a great day 2013 DMU ADP Hyden today let's run the axis a little bit back and forth and uh, you see the machine you know has a large travel small footprint machine and uh, again it's an ADP Hyden machine with TNC 430 full 5 axis uh, running table rotary table Z the C axis and the A axis how nice you can see that pendant how nice she looks here uh, has a oil mist here we can turn it on and you hear that up in that corner oil mist we can turn it off we run the machine 2500 rpm right now very nice and quiet let's jump up to 3500 very nice and quiet you don't hear it it's just like it runs very very nice you can see that I go a little bit closer HSK very nice previous owner 2012 I think he changed the spindle three to five microns run out and uh, again it's a full 5x machine from DMG ADP Heiden Deckel Maho built in Germany, Fronten, exactly Fronten, and uh, goes automatically horizontal and vertical. You can see that, go down and uh, the head swivels up and down automatically. So she goes far down, then you have horizontal spindle and tilt the head, tilt the table up to 45.5 degrees. I mean, very nice machine here again, the table almost no marks and scratches on there very very nice actually there's the head on the side vertical horizontal touch pro preparation from Randy Shaw you can order a touch probe if you like to and laser here so that's the whole machine it's a big machine but uh, it's actually not as uh, big the footprint is of the machine it's actually uh, about two three four five six seven eight about nine, nine to ten feet by seven foot about. So it has large travel for a small footprint actually. So uh, any question, give us a call. Thank you very much, europeanmachinetool.com. Show also the previous owner, uh, they had that machine also with the automatic kinematic setup. We see that here measuring probe must be in the spindle. The programs are in there like a 530 here. And uh, let's go down a little bit. So. Uh, BX must be in a vertical position, etc. This programs, everything is written. It's a calibration program for your kinematic. This machine has it already in there and it resets and you can put it e also in the parameters uh, and kinematic table, kinematic dot, dot tap, uh, like a 5-axis machine. Here everything is in there. It goes with the touch probe and uh, kinematic gets reset it. So the previous owner had that all bought when it was new or updated one time with automatic kinematic setup. And uh, here we go, it's a TNC 430. Uh, we see here the pendant again. Looks very clean here, the pendant. Had some stickers on it, etc. Uh, everything looks very nice. Everything very good. Buttons function, the key here. And uh, this is the switch for oil air mist automatic clamping or manual clamping this one is the power on and this one too when you work with open doors for safety etc and the keys in the electrical cabinet actually again that's the DMU ADP Hyden full 5 axis 60 tool 12,000 torque spindle machine here uh, any questions just feel free to give us a call again kinematic uh, programs are in this machine already September the 10, 2013, 5-axis DMU ADP TNC 430. Uh, it has also 3D rotation in here, 3D rotation. You activate that or cycle 19, activate that. ABC, it's your transform axis. And um, it has that also like a 530. And uh, let's go around here. We can see the tool table and uh, the pocket table here. Same like a 530, 430, X the same, same machine, same controls, etc. Has all these uh, uh, functions in there. And uh, let's go to, uh, let's go end of block out here and uh, go to MDI quick and call up cycle dev. And you see all the drilling, threading, pocket, coordinate and transfer, cycle pattern, multi pass, special cycles. And you have another one here. You know, it goes, you can select that, the Decomaho ones, you know, 
It's some special cycle, same, again, same like a 530, same thing here. And uh, special cycles, again, it's uh, different ones, you know, here in there. It's, again, 530 has maybe one or two, a uh, couple more cycles. But uh, core night and transfer, you see that all here, cycle seven. It's an old cycle seven, that's since 20 years by Heidenheim, you know. Uh, it has mirroring cycle 19 again. It's, it's everything in this control for 5x is simultaneous milling or positioning. So it's Heidenheim, it's very good control, very nice. Thrilling threads, etc. You can select 201, it changes here. Again, like a 530, it's all the Q parameters here. It tells you what it is, distance, setup, clearance. Everything tells you exactly like a 530 control. September the 10, 2013, 5X is DMU ADP TNC 430. Uh, it has also 3D rotation in here, 3D rotation. You activate that or cycle 19, activate that, ABC, it's your transform axis and um, it has that also like a 530. And uh, let's go around here, we can see the tool table and uh, the pocket table here. Same like a 530, 430, it's the same, same machine, same controls, etc. Has all these uh, uh, functions in there. And uh, let's go to, uh, let's go end of block out here and uh, go to MDI quick and call up cycle dev. And you see all the drilling, threading, pocket, coordinate and transfer, cycle pattern, multi playing here. And uh, special cycles again. It's uh, different ones, you know, here in there. It's again, 530 has maybe one or two, a uh, couple more cycles, but uh, core night and transfer, you see that all here, cycle seven. It's an old cycle seven, that's since 20 years by Heidenheim, you know. Uh, it has mirroring cycle 19 again. It's, it's everything in this control for 5X is simultaneous milling or positioning so it's Heidenheim it's very good control very nice thrilling threads etc you can select 201 it changes here again like a 530 it's all the Q parameters here it tells you what it is distance setup clearance everything tells you exactly like a 530 control